Good day and thank you for watching. This is Teacher Ryan and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is my fifth video on Nemeth Braille Code series and in this video I'm going to share with you some common abbreviations that are being used in math, particularly those that uh, appear as or are used as units of measurement. If you are new to my channel, kindly hit the subscribe button, also the like and uh, share buttons. So without further delay, let's get started. Firstly, what is an abbreviation? An abbreviation is a combination or group of letters that represent larger words. Now, we usually encounter abbreviations in English or in other languages. But uh, in mathematics, the, the context of the use of abbreviations is for mainly for um, units of measurement. The first set of abbreviations that I have here are the units of length. So here we have uh, the abbreviations for feet, letters F and T, inches, letters I and N, yard, letters Y and D, miles, letters M and I, millimeter, letters MM, Centimeter letters C and M, decimeter letters D and M, meter is letter M alone, and kilometer kil kilometer letters K and M. The second set has the units of volume or capacity. So we have here quart. The abbreviation for quart are letters Q and T, pint letters P and T, cup letters C alone, gallon, letters G-A-L or gal, ounce, letters O and Z, milliliter, letters M and L, and liter, letter L alone. For our next set, we have here the units of weight or mass. So we have the abbreviations for pounds, the letters L, B and S, for ton, letter T alone. For gram, letter G alone. And for kilogram, letters K and G. Now our last set of abbreviations are the units of temperature. Now, uh, two, uh, two common units of temperature are degrees Celsius and degrees Fahrenheit. Now these braille or the braille equivalent of these two units occupy around six or seven cells on our braille or our uh, material that's why there is a need to memorize the the code so let me begin with uh, degree celsius so for degree celsius the first cell contains dots four and five second cell contains dots four and six third cell that's one and six and then space then we have the letter indicator that's five and six that's six for the next cell which is the capital sign indicator and finally the letter c now if you notice the first cell containing that's four and five that that's four and five are actually the that's for superscript now in print the degree sign is actually or is like a superscript and there is a space as the letter C, which is a capital C, is separated from the degree symbol. Now, moving on to Fahrenheit, the Nemeth code or Nemeth Braille code for Fahrenheit has also six or seven cells. So for the first cell, we have that's four and five, next four, six, next one, six, space, Letter indicator, that's 5 and 6, that's 6, and final, final letter F. Moving on to the rules that govern these uh, abbreviations. First, these abbreviations may or may not be followed by a period. So here as an example, I have two contrasting examples. First is 15 cm without a period after cm. And then the other one is 37 km followed by a period so in braille 
obviously I need to write the numeric indicator that's and then digits 1 and 5 for 15 space and then the abbreviation CM without the period after say CM next for 37 km numeric indicator digits 3 and 7 space km and then period okay for our next rule it says here that we need to follow the literary rules if there is a capital letter or capital letters in the abbreviation so here is as an example i have here 21 liters now the abbreviation for liter is capital l so the braille equivalent should also has should also have a capital sign indicator so again we have here numeric indicator digits two and one space the capital sign indicator which is dot six letter l and followed by a period since in print there is a period next rule states that uh, a space should be uh, put before and after the abbreviation so to show that i have here two examples first is 30 gal or 30 gallons so that's uh, 30 space and then gal space next is 12 feet numeric indicator digits 1 and 2 space ft and then period now finally for our last rule it says here that if our abbreviation contains a single let letter and uh, it may be misread as a short form word so we need to put a letter uh, indicator unless it is followed by a period so here I have some examples first one is 75 meter so that's one letter the abbreviation for meter is letter M only so there is a need for us to use uh, the letter indicator that's 5 and 6 since M is not followed by a period here however for our next uh, example we have here 500 grams or 500 G since it is followed by a period there is no need to use the letter indicator that's 5 and 6 again for this rule uh, the letter indicator would only be used if the abbreviation is not followed by a uh, period but in cases wherein the abbreviation which is a single letter is followed by a period there is no need to use the letter indicator that's five and six so here for additional examples we have 36 uh, inches is equal to three feet so in Nemeth we need to write numeric indicator digits three and six space the abbreviation for inches which are letters I and N and followed by a period since the print equivalent has a period space then equal sign in Nemeth space and then uh, numeric indicator digits digit 3 space and then uh, feet the abbreviation for feet letters F and T and then period for our next example we have here 2 feet is less than 1 yard so in Nemeth we would write that down using the abbreviations so numeric indicator digit 2 or number 2 space the abbreviation for feet letters F and T then period space the symbol or the Nemeth uh, equivalent for less than that 5 for the first cell and then that's 1 and 3 for the second cell space numeric indicator digit 1 or number 1 space the abbreviation for yard letters Y and D with the period then finally for our last example at this uh, this point we have 37 degrees Celsius so in Braille in Nemeth Braille code that should be written numeric indicator digits 3 7 space 
Oh, there's no space. I mean, sorry. So there's no space. So af right after uh, seven, need to write the the Braille equivalent for uh, degrees Celsius. So that should be that's four five right after seven. Then that's four six. That's one and six. And then space letter indicator five six. That's six for capital sign. And then letter C. So here for our final two examples, we have 27 kilograms. So in Nemeth, we can write that, uh, of course, with the numeric indicator, digits 2 and 7, space, kg, and then period. Next, we have 108 degrees Fahrenheit, numeric indicator, digits 108. Without a space, you have to write, that's 4, 5, 4, 6, 1, 6, space, that's 5, 6, letter indicator, that's 6, capital sign, and letter F. I hope you learned something from this video. Thank you so much for watching. And I uh, hope to see you in my next video. I'd like to say uh, my deepest thanks to all my subscribers. So if you haven't subscribed, kindly hit the subscribe button and also like uh, this video. Thank you and God bless us.